Hey guys. Hello. How's everything? Good evening. How are you? Hello. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, guys. How are you? How was your weekend? Fine. It was great. <laughs> All good? Studying yes. English. <laughs> I bet. All right. Very good. Very good. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, Gio. How are you? Good. Hey, so I saw um I saw some of the the, the problems you had with the platform. So I reported it, guys. So the, the issue that we had in the in the first part of the platform should be fixed now. Okay. So did, did you did you redo it, guys? Did you get to do it again? Yeah. And yeah, um, what was it? Oh, there there was you know there was an issue there with, with the platform. So uh, once I reported, it, you know they they fixed it. Um. So. So you should be good to go now okay so that was let's see i think that was 1.2 all right so that one right there that is the one that i'm talking about okay so anyways uh so i'll share it guys here if you want to take a look at it meanwhile all right i'm just going to share it here and we're going to go over the exercises all right, so this one right here, guys, okay? This one, number three, asking someone's age is often the considered rule. Okay, hold on, let me get this, okay? All right, so this one right here, guys. This was uh, not taking the, the answer from, I'm sorry, it was not taking uh, this answer right here, right? So if you put it again, it should let you do it, see? So the answer, it's, it's often considered rude to ask someone's age, all right? So now that got fixed, all right? Very good, right? <laughs> you, you were very happy about it. Ah, uh, yeah. I can't even sleep about that. <laughs> yes. I miss the same, the same, the same eating too. <laughs> yeah. Okay, all right, but now you know, okay, now you know, so you can, you can fix it now. So anyways, guys, how was, uh, what do you do on, on the weekend, Ruth? Uh, I think you sent me a message about a minute ago or so. Oh, really? Uh, you're me today. Rosa, how was your... So what do you do on your weekend? Well, no, not too much. Just working on Saturday. Studying on, on Sunday. Just... Uh, Taking a lunch with my parents. Okay, oh, you took you you um you went uh, for a lunch to your parents' house, or or yes. did they live with yes. you? Yes, in oh. my sister's house. Oh, that's great. It's a meeting um, custom to meet in on Sunday. Oh, really? Every Sunday, yes, with the all the the grandsons, grand, all grandchildren, and them. Nice, nice, nice. So, all right, all right, very good. And uh, where was that at? Nice, it's, uh, very quiet. No, no, not too much noise because they are elder. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Okay. All right. What about you, Ricardo? Where did you go? Uh, I I the, the, the take the day off the, on Sunday <laughs> because oh, okay. I I had I I took a I took a, a little rest in the day off. <laughs> okay. All right. So you took you took a small rest, you man. Yes. Yes. All I right. Took the small... Okay. Very good. Very good. Okay. All right, guys, so we're going to move on now, guys, okay? Uh, we are going to go over the, the items of the platform, okay? But remember, I told you that I was going to I was gonna finish teaching you about the usage of say versus tell, right? So that's what we're going to do right now, guys. Okay, so moving forward, guys, uh, go to the 1.10 section, and we're going to start off from there, okay? So uh, remember, guys, when we're talking... In, um, in reported speech, 
the verb, right, the tense goes to the to the previous tense, right, to the past tense. Okay, so if you're talking in simple past, then to report, you know, what you're saying, what tense do you need to use? What do you think? Uh -huh. So simple past, remember, past perfect. Past perfect. Right, simple present. You do? It's past, a past, past tense. Okay, simple present, you do uh, simple past, right? Very good. Simple past. All right, really, really good job, okay. But, but I, I have the problem when, when there is this, uh, um, a command when the, you say uh, when the, you say it's a command is very difficult for me. What is the the, the construction of the, the form? You mean when it is uh, an imperative? A command is it's an imperative, right? So you mean when it when so you have issues when it's an imperative. All right, very good. Um, it's it's not. I'm not really sure. So so you're saying that you have issues if I say, for example. Uh, do your house chores, okay? So like this? Yes. Okay, how would you turn this into a reported speech, okay? So let's say that, let's say that, uh, I don't know, uh, Laura said this, right? So Laura said, that I have to. I have to do. <laughs> I I, I, say that I have to do my. That I had. That I had. Right. Yeah. To do my okay. chores. Yes. All right now, guys. The reason why. Listen. Um. So these right here, okay. When we're talking about, it's true. You know how this is how we report it, but this is not. There are like many. This is not as simple as, as it seems, guys, okay, right? Um, but this is not, if I go here, if I teach you this, okay, this is, this is not part of the agenda, okay? But just to let you know, guys, okay, this is how you would say something like that, okay? That Laura said that I had to do my chores. Or Laura said, um, Laura asked me to do my chores, okay? You can use other verbs as well, right? We're not gonna get there because that's you know it requires more than an hour okay all right what we are gonna jump into though all right it's about using um you know tell okay all right so let's 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 warm up guys okay so hi ma'am hello hi man. nice to see you here so let's see so hey. how will you put this uh these expressions together he claimed that he promised that Right. So tell me what he said, okay? So instead of telling me, guys, okay, when when you're going to talk about um, when you're going to talk about telling someone instead of that, you can actually use one of these sentence, one of these uh, expressions, guys. All right. You can say, "Oh, he claimed that." All right, everybody, repeat. He claimed that. He claimed that. He, claimed that. he asked me to. He asked me to. He wanted me not to. He wanted me not to. He promised to. He promised to. He wanted to know. He wanted to know. He explained that. He explained that. Okay. All right. He advised me to. He advised me to. He encouraged me to. Okay. He encouraged me to. He encouraged me to. He wondered. He wondered. He wondered. All right, very good, guys. Very good. Okay. All right. So all of these phrases, guys, can be used instead of of uh, stay. So let's say, for example, okay, let me bring up the whiteboard again. Right. So let's use the first one, guys. Okay. Let's look about. He claimed that. Okay, right here. So he claimed that. Okay. That right there. All right. So instead of saying he said, guys, instead of saying he said that, you can say he claimed that, okay? All right. So here you can say, for example, let's see. Um, let's say that uh, pill. Okay, we're going to call this person pill. P 
because of Bill Seno birth, okay? All right, we're just going to call him Bill, all right? So Bill, you know it. <laughs> Bill, okay, I right, said, hey, I like hot coffee, okay? So what can we, if, this is actually, when you say he claimed that, guys, okay, this is like, mostly you're going to, you're going to listen to this uh, on the news, okay? So how will you report this, okay? Uh, let's see, Rosa, okay? Yes. So how will you report that Phil said something like this? He told me that he likes the hot coffee. That's one way of saying it. Very good. What if, what if we wanted to use claim, right? He claimed his he claimed, he claimed his uh -huh. coffee hot. He claimed. Okay, right. You can skip. Hey, very good. Okay, I like that example because. Okay, you can you can skip this, guys. By the way, right? So you can say he claimed that, or you can say he claimed, right? So he claimed that his coffee is or was, guys. It's not. It's not hot. It's not what? It's not hot. It's not hot. What do you mean? Hot, not hot. Coffee. Okay, right. It's not or, uh, or wasn't hot, guys. Was not. Okay, it wasn't hot, right? Wasn't hot. Wasn't hot. All right, so you can say it's not hot, guys. He, like, if you only if you're reporting it like right about now, if it's hot right now, okay, and he's saying it right now, okay, got it. All right, very good, guys. Uh, next example, okay, let's use which one do you want to use from the from the examples that we have here, guys? Which one do you want to use? All right, so which one do you want to use here? He wanted to know. Okay, he wanted to know, all right? Let's use that. Now, with that expression, guys, okay, you have to use the clause here, okay? So let's try, let's try to see if we can use the same example. Okay. So he wanted to know. Okay. Now here, guys, the, the whole phrase actually should be, he wanted to know if, okay? Yeah. Yeah. Not only he wanted to know, okay, so uh, add if, okay, add, we're going to add another clause here, and that's going to be if, okay. Now, can I use, okay, question for you guys, and, and just think about it just just by, by common sense, okay, and then I'll give you the answer. Right here, guys, when he says, all right, um, I like hot coffee, can I report this with he wanted to know if? If not, uh, can you tell me why not? What do you think? Why not? It's cough. It's hot. And my question is: Is it okay? Okay. So how will you how will you use this, guys? Can you, can we report? I like hot coffee. With he wanted to know if. He wanted to know if the coffee was hot. Mm -hmm. Okay, he wanted to know if the, the coffee, coffee, if your coffee, was hot. if your coffee was hot. Okay. Now, okay. So if I told you something like that, guys. So if I say, if I hear like, um, I don't know. If I hear Chepe, right, saying, "Oh my God, dude, I like my coffee hot." Okay, or I like a hot coffee. Okay. If I hear, if I hear Chepe saying that. Okay, and I say something like he wanted to know if, if the coffee likes his, co his, his, his coffee hot. Is that, is that, was he asking a question or was he making a sentence, guys? This is a question that you have to ask yourselves, okay? Because you can also report questions, okay? Hmm. And this, guys, is this a, okay, I'm sorry. Um, is this a question, guys, or is this a sentence? It's a, sentence. it's a sentence. It's a sentence, right? If I told you that somebody wanted to know something, is this a question or is this a sentence? It's a question. It's a question, it's a question right? And there, okay, there lies the answer. Because you so, need information about something. So here, guys, we cannot, okay, we cannot report this sentence with he wanted to know if, okay? So what can we do? 
All right. Let's let's all right. Let's talk about Reg. Okay. This is the name of the other person because of Rehim. All right. Very good. So, anyways. <laughs> so, uh, so let's say that uh, Regia, right, Reg, was asking Bill, okay, do you like hot coffee? Hey, hey, Bill, do you like hot coffee? Am I missing a, an F there, guys? I'm sorry. Okay, all right, so Reg, do you like hot coffee? All right, here, guys. So what do you think? He, he no. wanted to know if, if I like, like hot coffee. If I, I are you are you are you okay, pill? If, if I like <laughs> hot coffee. No, no, no. Okay, you're gonna report. Okay, you're gonna report. Remember, who is he talking to? Is he talking to you or or is he talking to Pill? Who is he talking Bill? to? Guys? Who is Reg? Who is Reg talking to? Pill? Or is he talking to you? Is he, all right? Talking to Bill. Bill. He's talking to Bill. Bill. Okay, this is a conversation between Regia and Bill. All Bill. right, very good. So now, I want you to report me that Regia is asking Bill about a hot coffee. And this is where mm -hmm. this comes into place, okay? He wanted to know if... Regia? Do me a favor, everybody send me send me your example of what you think the answer is, okay? So Ruth, Rosa, Gio, Jordana, uh, uh, Veronica, okay. Let's see, Ricardo, Jaime, Carla, Carlos, Adriana. Uh, Adriana, I think you're, you're busy, but everybody send me an example. Send me your answer, guys, in the chat, okay? And then we're going to go from there, okay? So here, guys, okay, uh, let's try G, okay? What do you think the answer is here? Uh, Reg wanted to know if Bill likes hot coffee. If Bill, okay, remember, let's talk in the past, okay? If Bill? Uh, like, 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 I don't liked. Like, like, like hot coffee. Hot coffee, very good, man, like. okay? Good job, Bill. I mean, good job to you. <laughs> mm. <laughs> all right. All right. Very good. Okay, so this is this is how you do it, guys. Okay, he wanted to know if Bill liked hot coffee, right? Very good. Okay, so you can use it for any question, guys. Say, hey, what? What about a WH question? Can we use it there? All right. What? What did you do yesterday? Okay. Let's say that that Reg is saying now. You know, hey, Bill, what did you do yesterday? And what did you do yesterday? Okay. Now, question to you. Okay, try to answer it too, guys. Send me the answer in the chat as well, okay? So I want you to tell me, guys. Maybe can we use, can we use, uh, he wanted to know if. With this, what do you think? No, because it's a WH question. Hey, all right, very good, very good. He wanted to know. Now here, guys, if it is a WH question, what? most what? scenarios, what? you are yeah. gonna, you're not gonna use if, okay? What? All right? No. Is that it? Because you're not using do, yeah. okay? You're not using the auxiliary, okay? You're not just using do or does. You're gonna say, he wanted to know what, okay? Yeah. The WH word works as a, relative clause um, um as a as a yes as a relative clause guys okay what you did yesterday see he wanted to know what you did yesterday all right now for you guys okay answer this one okay in the chat and then i'll ask you to okay who did you go out with okay let's answer this who do you go out with I wanted to know who you went out with. Very good. Okay. He wanted to know who you went out with. Okay. Sure. Now you will need to know, guys, and, and this is a topic that you have reviewed, right? Do you remember relative clauses? Okay. 
And this is a relative pronoun here. This works as a relative pronoun. This works as a relative pronoun, right? So remember the questions turn turn into a sentence, right? So far, so good, guys? Yes. All right. Very good. Okay. All right. Now, so now about that, teacher, I have a question on the knowledge check of 1.8. Uh, oh, we're going to get there sentence. soon. Um, okay, good. All right, we're going to get there soon, okay? We'll we'll go over the, the exercise. Don't worry, okay? But so far, guys, do we have a question here? We, do we have a question with the sentences so far? Okay, with the... Um, uh, go ahead. No, I don't think... No, I don't think so. Mm, but like on the previous one, when we used set... Mm -hmm. We just change it to the past tense, right? Yes, yes. Now on this one, it's the same. Uh, it's the same. Yes, the rules that you've learned so far they don't change, guys. Okay. They don't change. All right. Okay. So if you're talking in the past, that would be you would change it to past perfect, right? So it is the same. All right. Good question, Ruth. All right. Okay. Thank you for bringing that up because that is true. You know, it just changes. Okay. Very good, guys, right? So we're going to go over, guys. Um, we're going to practice, but we're going to go over the next exercise, okay? All right. So let's review, guys, the answers for the platform, okay? All right, so we can all have it available. So according to the exercise, to the listening exercise that you did already, guys, uh, what is the answer for number one? Letter A. Letter A. All right. A. Very good. All right. Uh, what about Tony? Answer. Okay, this is B, right? Okay. Yeah. What about number one from uh, part two? Um, over four years ago. Four years ago. Yeah, no, four years ago? Yeah. Repeat, yeah. guys. Four years ago. Oh. Four, four years, years, ago. years ago. All right. Four go, four right? Years. go, go, go. Four years. Right. Go. Uh, go. Number go. number two, guys. Nicole's sister. Not afraid. To be different. It's okay. not afraid to be different. Nicole's sister different. is not afraid to be different. Okay, very good. Number three. The, there is not enough many work. things. Not enough okay. work. Okay, there is enough. There is work. nothing enough work. All right, number four. In less than a month. In less, month. In less than a month. Okay, right. right, let's. Good job, guys. Ooh, very, very, very good. Good. All right. good, 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 okay. All right, uh, what about the reading exercise? I mean, this one, do you have a question with this, guys, with this one? Oh. Actually, let, let's solve it just to have it, you know, for whoever needs it online, okay? All right, uh, what's the answer for number one? The shouter. Shouter. The shouter, okay, what's the, sh the shouter, guys? Someone who screams. Scream. scream. Okay, very good. All right, number two. Corporate big shot. Corporate big shot. The uh, corporate big shot. Repeat, guys. Corporate. 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 Okay, very good. Okay, corporate. big shot. Corporate big shot. Big shot. Okay, very shot. good. Uh, number three, Carla. What is number three? I haven't done this yet. Okay, right, very good. Uh, guys, who has not finished, by the way, we need to finish this uh, by by Thursday last week. <laughs> okay, but if you're not done, guys, okay, please finish it today, okay? Who? But but I need to know, guys, who has not finished it, uh, finished it yet? Teacher, I only have problem with the other part when you write the information. Okay, all right, we're gonna get there, okay? But okay, so I got uh, who else, guys? Who else has not finished? Section number two. Section number one. I mean, section one. number one, guys. I'm sorry. Section number one. Yeah. yeah. I have that question at 1.8. All right. Very good. Very good. Okay. All right. So I only had two people then. All right. Very good. All right. So what's the answer for number three, guys? The useless, the user, 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 useless call maker. The useless call maker. Okay. maker. All right, number four. I talk uh, anywhere. I talk, talk anywhere. Talk anywhere. Talk anywhere. All right, the I talk anywhere. Very good. Number five. 
Driver. Driver. Okay, the distractor driver, very good. And I number six. Driver. The generic, the generic ring. ring. The generic, the generic ring. ring. Okay, very good, guys. Really, really good. Okay. All right, let's jump into the other section then. All right. So this is the one. Hold on. Wait, number one point eight. Yeah, one point <laughs> eight. Let me go back because. Yes, I uh, have problem with this part too. Okay, right, 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 right. I have the pull summits in the the correct is okay. <laughs> one point eight. Oh, this one right here. Oh, how did I skip this one? I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, that's good, guys. Okay, so let's solve this together. But uh, we're not only gonna. I'm not gonna give you the answers, guys. You're gonna give me the answers and why you think the answers look like that. Okay. All right. First of all. All right, uh, which, which do you have issues with all of them or do, with, with just some of them? Yes, I have like four, five, six, and eight. Okay, all right, let's see guys. Okay, let's solve this together then. Rewrite the sentences using reported speech. Remember to use capital letters and periods. You may use that or not, okay? So this is optional guys, by the way, right? That is optional, you don't have to use it necessarily, all right? So I'm not surprised at all, okay? So you're gonna use, she told me, all right? And the example is, uh, she told me that she wasn't surprised at all, okay? I see that, okay, you can use contractions. And uh, she told me that she wasn't surprised at all. Okay, well, actually the only thing that, that, that changed here was using that and or not, yeah. right? So let's see, I'm not surprised, she told me. Mm -hmm. All right, let's see. What do you have for that, uh, Ricardo? Okay, she, she told me oh, she wasn't surprised. <laughs> she okay. <laughs> okay, so she told me, she told me that she wasn't, she wasn't surprised, surprised at, all. at all. At all. Okay, very good. At all. All right. Uh, Gio, what do you have for number two? Oops. Number two. He asked me if I had heard the news. If I have heard that the news. news. Okay, very good. All right. Number three, uh, Jordana, what do you have? She said that there was um, there was a bank down the street. She said that there was a bank down the street, okay? All right, very good. And this is this is wrong, right? What you brought no, here? Number seven is the one that I got. Oh, okay, right, very good. Okay. All right, uh, let's see. Veronica, all right, number four. Is there? I can do it. I put, she asked me if you were not talking. Okay. But it's wrong. All right. That's understandable because I just, well, I just taught you about that, okay? But we're gonna solve this together really, really, really quick, guys, okay? Uh, remember what I explained, guys, when there is a WH word? So hold on, Here all right, let me, let me, let me make this bigger. Um, all right, hold on. So here's the, 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 the answer for that. Let me go back to the whiteboard, okay? So remember, we have a, we have a WH word, right? So remember this example, what did you do yesterday? What did you do yesterday, right? So if you wanna use, she asked me, or she wanted to know, you know, anything, an expression that, that we use for making questions, guys, okay? Do this in your notebook right now, guys, and try to, try to report this, okay? You can report this with, you know, he or whoever is talking, right? He asked me or he wanted to know, okay? Or you can say he was wondering. A lot of, you know, you can use a, a lot of expressions, guys, okay? So let's use he asked me, okay? So we're going to talk about he asked him, okay? So what do we do here? So what we do here, guys, is this, okay? When you have a WH word, you are gonna transform this sentence right here into, I mean, this question right here into a sentence, okay? So 
stop thinking about he asked me or she asked me or or he wanted to know okay what you do is this guys okay when you have a wh question you are going to erase the auxiliary and you're going to change the main verb in the past okay all right so it works like this okay if we do that, guys, what is the yeah. sentence that we will have uh, here? Uh, let's see, Carlos de Leon. What sentence do we, we uh, what sentence would we end up with if we do that? Um, I need to follow the example, or in the in the exercise, yeah, I, because I, I don't have that that answer. Okay, um, right. Don't worry. Don't worry. Kid. According, remember. Can so, I try? Go ahead, go ahead, try. Um, he asked me what I did yesterday. Okay, right, right. Without uh, without saying he asked me, guys. Okay, very good. That that's that's good. That was perfect. But it's what I did yesterday. See? What I did yesterday. All right. Now you can say here, guys. Okay, now this becomes easier because of this. See? All right, hold on. Let me. You can say here, for example, he asked me, see, you can say he asked me what I did yesterday, right? You can say he, what was the other expression, guys? He wants to know. He wanted to know. Wanted okay. He wanted to know. So he wanted to know. And guess what? What do you what think? I gonna... Yesterday. Okay, what he I wanted to yesterday. know what I did yesterday, right? Did. All right, very good. So let's write, let's give another example, okay? All right, so Carla, ask me a question, Carla Molina. Um, what is your favorite? What is your what? Favorite, favorite music. Okay, what is your favorite music? Okay, now let's do this more complicated. What was your favorite song when you were a kid? Okay, hey man, what was your favorite song when you were a kid? Okay, so this is what Carla asked me just now. Okay, thank you so much, Carla. All right, all right, so this is Carla speaking, guys, and she this is what she asked me. Okay. All right, so first of all, guys, let's follow let's follow the rules, guys. Okay, let's get let's erase some of the things that we need to get rid of. Okay, the first thing that we need to get rid of, Jaime, what is it? In. Uh huh. What do you think? Uh, she, she asked me. Uh huh. Very good. She asked me was. Okay, but, go ahead. No, no, no. All right. Um, the only thing that I'm asking, all right, listen to the question, Jaime, please. Uh, I need you to erase. I need you to, we need to get rid of some things here, okay? So what do we need to erase here? To, to turn it into a sentence, guys, what do we need to do? What? Erase what? Was okay. Okay. When? Okay. Was and when? And when? Oh. Are okay. You, what your favorite song? All right. Let me give you this example, guys. Okay, because this is a different, a different sense. Okay, so let's use the expression. Uh, he wanted, he wanted to know. Okay, he wanted. To know now, you notice that we're not using the, the the auxiliary do or does here. We're using was, right? The verb be. So he wanted to know. I'll give you one example, and then you do the other one. Okay. He wanted to know what, right? Ooh. Had been, and then it's the same. Your favorite. Okay. 
your favorite song when oh, you yeah. were yeah, a kid. kid. All right. So I wanted to know what had been your favorite song when you were a kid. All right. Is it in past? Is it is it in the perfect uh, past perfect guys? Yes or not? Yes. Past perfect. All yeah. right. This is sure. past perfect. He wanted to know what had been your favorite song when you were a kid. Yeah. The rest. Sure. Rest works as a compliment. No question. Go ahead. Uh, it's necessary to put the 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 question mark at the end. No, no, it's not. I'm sorry. That was my bad. I always do that. <laughs> just, it's just, I'm crazy. Okay, but, but. Uh, <laughs> no, guys, maybe, you don't, you don't need to. Maybe, but, but, to, but in this case, you, maybe in this case, you are, you have to know, uh, wanted to know what Carla, uh, what Carla's favorite song music uh, like when, when, when she was a kid. No. Mm -hmm. Oh, what was your favorite music music when you were a kid? No, Carly's asking me. Ah, asking. Carla asking. Right. Okay, okay. Yes. All right. She's not asking herself. She's asking. Yeah, yeah. Me. Carla is asking you. Yes, yes. By the way, guys, no, you don't need to use um a question mark. Okay, I just do that because of I just do that automatically. I don't know why, guys. <laughs> okay, but no, this is a sentence, so you don't need to use a question mark. Okay. Now, with that being said, guys, all right, let's go back to the knowledge check, okay? And now, this is a simple question. This one is super easy because it's in present progressive, right? All right. So, let's see. Remember, present progressive cha progressive changes to what? She asked me. Okay, let's see, okay? What? So, she asked... Okay, don't look at the answer. Just... <laughs> so she asked me. She uh, asked me. She asked me. Uh -huh. Why? I wasn't why? talking. Why? Very good. Okay. Why? Why? I wasn't was talking. I wasn't talking. talking. But I, okay. I wasn't talking. Okay, she asked me why I wasn't talking. Okay. Now, guys, this is this is like I I don't want I don't want you to translate. Every guys never translate. Okay, but this is like, how would you say Chepe said, you know, like something like, hey, por qué no estás hablando? And then you come and then you you report this to somebody else. Hey, mira, sí. quería saber por qué no estaba, estabas hablando, right? That's how you say it in Spanish, guys, see? The same thing, teacher. you're talking in the past. Go ahead, go ahead, Ruth. No, teacher, my my mistake is uh, that I put uh, if instead of why in the, in the sentence. Yes. Yes. That has been a mistake. Yes, we okay. We also explained that too, right? Um, when do we use if? When is uh, to be? When or, we use question. do or does, okay? Do then when know. the auxiliary is this, then you change this to mm -hmm. if. Okay. Right. When is okay. that? When it is. Right. I need. I very good. So, uh, when it's um, a wh word then you keep the WH word and you transform everything else into a sentence, right? In the past. When it is, yes, when it, to the, to the pre, guys, not the past, to the previous sentence. If it is ah. simple past, you transform it into past perfect. If it is past perfect, then it is oh, past okay. perfect, right? Very good. Uh, if it is the verb be, right? You will use was or where, now this depends, guys. If you're talking about if you're gonna use some, uh, I mean, uh, past perfect or present, you know, uh, I'm sorry, past perfect, then you would need to change this to have been, right? Just keep that in mind. All right, very good. All right, number five, guys. Okay, try to finish it all, guys. Okay, tell me if, if it gives you uh, an error. All right, uh, what do we have for number five then? Um, let's see. Uh, who, who wants to give me number five, guys? I try it. He told me if. Okay. He told me if. Remember, this is this a question? He told no. me to give him a call. Okay, this is not a question, right? So. He told me, he told me to give him a call. Told me to. 
No, no. Oh, I'm sorry. We're doing number five. Okay, I'm sorry. You mm -hmm. were, okay. Uh, all right. So he told me, all right, this is this is a, an imperative, right? This is a command, all right? So these guys is usually you're going to use, uh, you're going to use an infinitive, right? He told me to give him a call, right? Very good. Number six, what do we have for number six? Uh, oh, by the way, is this wrong, guys? Is this, was this wrong for you? He told me, give him a call. No, that's no. right. Okay, very good. All right, number six, what is number six? Um, she told me they were getting married. Married. Okay, all right. She told me they weren't were getting, getting married, right? Very okay. good. They were. Oh, they, they, were. they were. Okay, I'm sorry. All right, yeah. they were getting married. Okay, good job. Okay. All right, number seven. What do you have for number seven? The children ask me. Ask, ask me. Ask me if. if. If the movie. Very good. Okay. That children. If the movie is scary. If the movie, if if the the movie, movie has been scary. Has been scary. Good job. Thank you for not telling what's scary. Has been scary, right? See, because you're reporting that in the past of the past, right? All right. And uh, uh, number eight. What do you have for number eight? They taught me they didn't take the eight. They told me. I'm sorry. They, they told me they take. didn't take. Okay, they told me they didn't take. The the eight eight no, they they eight told me eight that eight they, told they, me. Do, they didn't. They, they told, told me. me. Okay. I mean, you they, can use that or not. This is option, guys. This is optional, okay? It's optional. It's optional. Yes. Okay, yeah, they it. told me that. They didn't take. They didn't okay. take they the eight, train. didn't eight take. trains. Okay, now they didn't take guys. The eight train. The eight. The, the eight train. Eight train. Okay, they told me they didn't take, they didn't the, take eight. the eight train. All right. right. Now you can also guys see what what will be the what will be the past of the past guys. Would it be possible to say they told me they, they hadn't taken the eight train? Yes, you can, right? Very good. Let's see, guys. Let's see what we got here. Very good. Okay, so we got number two, number three. All right. Very good. Let's see. Have you heard the news? He asked me if I have heard the news. All right. I know what's wrong there. Uh... So who has number two right, guys? And what's wrong? Explain to me what's wrong if I say, he asked me yeah, if I have yeah. heard the roots. I have heard. I have the heard. Well, what's wrong here? I have heard the news. He asked me. Her. He asked me if I if I have. Had. Had. Very good. Okay. All right. Very good. Okay. So I have heard the news. Good job. All right. After. Good job. All right. Number three. She said that. Was it? She the, said that why am there. I saying? She, she said yeah, that there really was, was a, a there. She said that there, uh, there was a there bank was down, down the street. A bank, a bank down the street. Bank down, down the street. All right, very good. Now here, guys, who has this correct, guys? Me. She just missed that. Okay, right, they, they told me that. that. They told me that. Mm -hmm. They, they didn't take the eight, the eight, 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 eight train. Didn't take the eight train. Train, okay, very good. All right, so let's see. Good okay. job, guys, and there you go. Okay, applause okay. for you guys. One hundred percent. Did it. Okay. Can you repeat the last one, please? <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh, I'll I'll send it here. Actually, wait, wait, wait. With the last one, okay. I mean, you should be able to solve it now, but I'll send it here, okay. All right, they told me that they didn't take the train. Now here, guys, if this was just in, if remember, you can you can you can report something in the same tense sometimes, but we could also have said they told me that they hadn't taken the train, the they 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 hadn't taken the eight train. Okay, so it is possible to say they told me that they hadn't taken the eight. Train, okay. okay. All right. 
So that would be another excessive laser, but that's um, not, not for the platform here, okay? I don't know why I left it like that, because every, like all the other questions were used in the same formula, all right? But either way, guys, okay, that's how you do it, all right? Any question, guys? Any question here? No. No? No more questions. Okay, all right. So I'm going to divide you guys, and I'm going to be checking you, okay? I'm going to divide you into groups of three, and this is what you are going to do, okay? So person number, person number one, you will tell a brief story, okay? Now, actually, you know what? You will talk about yourself, okay? For a little bit, okay? Just for a little bit. Person number two, you will actually, let's actually report to the same person so we can work in couples and everybody works, okay? So you will report what person one was talking about, okay? Now, how are you gonna do this, guys, okay? For example, let's see, Gio, tell me something. Tell me something about yourself. You have to be taking notes, guys, okay, all right? Step number three, guys, take notes, okay? And I'll show you in real time how the, how that's done. Okay, Gio, tell me, tell me about your life. Okay, tell me who you are. Who is Gio? Yes. Um, I'm a person that enjoy to hear metal music. Okay. And and enjoy to eat a lot. Okay. <laughs> and okay. and to I like to to play video games. Uh -huh. And to repair things. <laughs> okay. Okay, very good. Okay. Yeah, All right. Hey, and, and, hey, yeah. Okay, very good. Okay. All right. So this is a small example, guys. Okay. You you don't have to talk about all the things that you like only. Okay. You can talk about anything, guys. Okay. So these are my notes. Okay. So I can say, hey, Gio told me that he's a person who likes metal. You know, he likes eating and he, like, he likes playing video games and fixing things. Or you can say, uh, Gio uh, said that he's a person who liked metal, eating, playing video games, and fixing things, All right? All right, so, or you can say, Gio okay. said that he liked metal. Gio said that he liked eating. Gio mentioned that he played video games. Gio stated that he fixed Thanks. Got it? Yes. Okay. All right. Very good. Is it all clear, guys, on what we're going to do? I'm going to ask you right yeah. now, okay? So if you are, if you have a question, let me know or I'm going to ask you. All right. Uh, let's see. Carlos de Leon, what are we going to do right now? What is the activity? Okay. Uh, we, will, we will work in pairs. Uh, the person number one, we talk about himself, herself, okay. and, the person, and the person number two will report everything that the person number one said. Very good, okay, good job, all right, you got it, you got it, you got it, you got it, all right. Very good, guys, okay. so we are gonna, hold on, Adriana, hey, Adriana, are you, I don't know if Adriana, you're working, Adriana, because I haven't. Yes, I'm here. Oh, okay, all right, very good, thank you. All right, so I'll get you together then. All right, guys, let's work. Carlos de Leon, how are you, sir? And Hello. Veronica. All Hi. right, guys. let me hear you guys. Okay. Hello, I'm doing great. What about you? Hello, Veronica. How are you? Hi, and you? I'm doing great, thank you. Okay. Tell me about this, uh, about yourself. Okay, um, talking about myself. Well, I'm a. I try to be a a good person. You know, uh, uh, I. I sometimes I try to be kind and polite. Sometimes. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> because in in different situations, I I I try to avoid it, but. Sometimes I deploy because of the people, of the situation in the world, you know, but maybe it's a, a normal thing. Uh, I like to 
I like to travel, I love to read, and, and spend time with my family and friends. Where do you work, Carlo? I work in a company called uh, Covenant. Uh, it's, a, it's a company uh, that sells uh, cybersecurity solutions. It's like, um, software, like software, but focused on cybersecurity. Oh, interesting. You are an engineer. No. Actually, no. I am more related to the to the business side of the of the solution. Ah, okay. Yep. Interesting. Yeah. Mm. Um, no, no, sir. I, I'm I no, work no, I, I was just I was just sending uh, <laughs> feedback to Veronica. Okay. You said you are engineer, right? That's incorrect. Are you and are then you an engineer? In English, engineer. you always have to use articles, okay? Okay. Or, uh, to refer to um, to work. Question. Um, you know, to, to job positions, okay? Okay. All right. Very good. All right. Uh, do you need that I ask to you or do you prefer to report? what I say before. I don't know what you prefer. <laughs> uh, Veronica will report what you said, Carlos. Okay. okay. Yes. Carlos told me that I try to be polite with the person and sometimes it's difficult for him because the situation. I, uh, because Carlos, of the situation. Because of situation. No, because of uh, that situation. Ah, uh, the situation. Okay, uh, Carlos told me that um, they, he liked to travel, Beautiful. to read and spend time with his family. Good job, Veronica, good job, Veronica. All right. That was good, that was really good, okay, I liked it. Continue practicing, oh, I'm sorry, I have to check on the other uh, group, okay? Okay. Very good. Great. That I'm a bored person because uh, I love to stay at home and uh, watch. I like to watch movies or series. And I love to watch videos um, on YouTube. And sometimes I like to, to draw or read. And that's all. Okay, what kind of reading do you like? Well, actually, I like to read comics or mm. mangas or interesting books. Ah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's good. Yeah. All right, very good. All right, good job, Adriana. Uh, let's see, Michelle, let's report. Let's report what Adriana said, okay? Okay. She said she liked to watch videos on YouTube. Uh -huh. Also, she said she enjoyed to drink coffee. To what? To drink, okay, to drink coffee, okay. I think that was all. Okay, all right. Uh, that, that was good, okay? You actually reported it very well, okay? Ricardo, uh, would you like to to do it as well? Would you like to report it? Okay, about, uh, about Michelle? Yes. Um, okay. Uh, she say, she, she, she say that uh, he likes- She said. Uh, no, she she said. said. She, uh -huh. she said, right? Uh -huh. She said. He said that uh, she like uh, uh, watch a video um, uh, about politic politic theme. Um, he like he like uh, study grammar. <laughs> okay. All right. What else? Um, I think that, that that's that that's all. They, they, they say that. <laughs> 
Okay. All right. Very good. Okay. I'm going to check on the other guys and uh, keep practicing. Okay. Good job. Okay. Good, 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 good job. Technologies. It's a yes, uh, yes. company for technology. Oh, okay, so, so you're you are you reporting. Okay, so who's who's gonna report now? I, I am. Okay, right. So report to me. Carla, oh. what? Half my report. <laughs> okay, right. so report to me okay. what Ruth was talking about. Ruth was talking about um, that she likes to be indoors. Okay. That she was, she liked to be what? I'm sorry. Indoors, she doesn't want to get out of home. She likes to, to stay in, at home. Okay, all right. She she also, likes to stay home. Okay. She likes. She said that she likes to spend time with her son and and mother. Okay. What else? And that she works uh, at um, an IT company. Oh, okay. All right. Very good. Very good. All right. Good job. Good job, girls. Uh, we're going to have to go back now. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, just I have some news for you and uh, we're going to have to go back. Okay. But good job. All right. Okay. That was good, Carla. Very well done. Okay. All right. Very good. good. We did good. <laughs> Let's go. All right. All right, guys. All right, guys. So tomorrow, guys, we, um, first of all, guys, uh, well done. Okay. I think that you did an excellent job at reporting. Actually, I honestly, I didn't expect you to do so well. Uh, so very well done, guys, to the, uh, for the ones I heard, guys, very well, well done. Okay. I didn't have the time to listen to all of you because I was giving feedback to some of you guys. So, but we're gonna, you now we're gonna get there, right? Now, one thing, guys, I do want to ask you, please, uh, to finish. And please, guys, this is like really, really important. Okay, I needed to finish the section one already. Okay, because uh, at the end of this week, guys, there are two things that we're gonna do. Okay, so we'll finish section two. And uh, in your own free time, you know, you're going to have to finish the midterm, okay? There is a yeah, midterm yeah. at the end of this section, all right? Yeah. So tomorrow, guys, we're going to use, we're going to go over, uh, review, guys, some present perfect and simple past, all right? Um, which is not, it's not going to take too long, guys, okay? We'll be able to finish this on time. Um, but I'll try, guys, on, on Friday, on Friday, okay? We're gonna review adverbs, um, so you can finish the platform on that, the section two at least on that day. I mean, you can finish all the whole platform if you want right now, guys. Be my guest, but my guest, on please. Friday? But, but on Friday, no, no, no. I mean, you can finish the platform at any at any point, okay? I just, uh, I just rather you finish the plat to finish the platform with, um, with with me though, okay? So we. Because otherwise, you know, sometimes, you know, we tend not to come to class because we have finished the, the platform already, right? But anyways, okay, as long as we have finished section one, by now, guys, we're going to be absolutely fine, okay? All right. Other than that, guys, uh, do we have any questions? Uh, I'm sorry, I had a couple of issues with the section 1.2, but uh, I will ask maybe in the, in the chat. That, that's somebody. right. You can also watch the videos online. You can ask the, the, on the group um, and you can also watch the classes online. They're uploaded every, like as soon as I finish the class, guys, I upload the class, okay? So we always have the answers within the class and this is the reason why I ask you to finish the exam with me, you know, to the tests so we can have visibility if you ever need to, to do that, okay? Got it? Okay, great. Thanks. All right, very good. All right, guys. So uh, if you don't have any further questions, guys, thank you very much for joining tonight. Um, be early tomorrow, okay? Because I'm going to start early tomorrow. And uh, I'll see you guys, okay? Take care. Okay. Goodbye. Bye. 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 Have a good night, everybody. Thank you, guys.
Be safe, Bye. Bye.